These are the top 10 things you should be buying at Costco in July 2021. Welcome back to the channel. I'm the YouTube deal guy, Matt Granted. How is it already July? This year has flown by, at least compared to last year. I'm going to bring you inside my local Costco and unveil the top computer deals, catering platters, security lights, dessert bargains beyond belief that I bring home to try, plus how you can increase your bathroom storage for just 85 bucks. This video is not sponsored in any way, and if you do like what you see, please feel free to give this video a thumbs up or share it with any other fellow Costco shoppers. The first thing you should be buying in July, luggage. I know this is not particularly helpful after that 4th of July travel rush, and I do hope you had an amazing, happy, and celebratory 4th, but all of the luggage items that were on sale leading into 4th of July are now clearance products, and they're actually looking better than ever. Let me show you these offerings at Costco. They're kind of plug-and-play suitcase concoctions. So for example, this hard carry-on piece of luggage that you see right here for $59.99 comes with packing cubes. The soft carry luggage that you see right here with the nice cream interior, I feel like I'm trying to sell a car, but I'm not. Buy what you like, $54.99 with packing cubes, but it's so simple. You just bring your clothing or whatever it is that you want, place it into the suitcase, and it almost does all of the work to prep you for more efficient packing. If you are traveling to a beach or just trying to enjoy your favorite music in your backyard, buy a pool, a lake house, this outdoor LED speaker, not a new concept at Costco, but I do like the $69.99 price that you see right here, and this one has this flame effect that can actually be custom so it can sync with the beats of your music. You can create a nice romantic candle effect. You can do it all. A nice $30 price drop on this speaker to kick things off. In the number two spot, two awesome pieces of tech that you might want to consider for your home. First, there is the iRobot Roomba i8 Plus self-emptying robotic vacuum. And if you have tested or at least seen almost every RoboVac on the market, as I have, I feel like I devote too much of my free time to this, you'll know that the i8 Plus at $699 is actually highly enticing in the self-emptying robotic vacuum world. Why is that? Well, the i7 Plus, which is the model down, sells for $100 more everywhere else at the time I'm uploading this video compared to the i8 Plus. The i8 Plus is now a Costco exclusive, so is the price. It has LiDAR mapping technology, so it actually draws an internal floor print of your home, learns where the furniture is for a more efficient cleaning. Also, a KitchenAid food processor. 69 bucks, 2.1 liter, nine cup food processor capacity, looking mighty fine as a top July buy at Costco. Before I tackle home security in the number three spot and get to some desserts, including two of which were so great, I couldn't leave the parking lot without consuming them in my car. Let's start with a flood security light combination. Right now, you see it on your screen, $129.99. Why would I consider this versus a Ring or a Blink security product that typically retails for at least $50 more? This floodlight that you see right here rated to be very bright, and unlike many other outdoor security camera systems, there is no subscription fee required to use this. Alternatively, if you just need an LED security light, I found one that's bright and beautiful for under 40 bucks. If you are looking for a better way to contain your hose in the garden, this decorative metal hose cart for under 100 bucks looks very nice, but more importantly, it is constructed very well. It has aluminum connectors and a five-year leak free guarantee warranty to accompany it. If you missed out on one of those huge 4th of July epic patio sales, do not feel compelled or pressured to buy now. The next set of real deals will approach with Labor Day, but you can upgrade your current furniture by taking advantage of these seat replacement pads. Nice colors, highly comfortable, $29.99 scores you a pack of two, and perhaps you can hold on to your patio furniture for a little bit longer with this simple upgrade. In the number four spot, get ready for one of my biggest Costco dessert lineups ever, and then I will get to some work from home tech options. Let's begin with this Caramel Macchiato set. Now, this is particularly epic given that it is $9.99. First, you score this incredibly delicious made in Italy caramel macchiato dessert that is then served in these espresso cups that you can hold on to afterwards and use time and time again. And yes, you can bet I brought this home. $9.99 for six cups on its own is great, but when you actually take into account that these cups are filled with one of the better desserts that I have tried in a long time, this is a keeper. You guys might remember the champagne flute dessert that I took home from Costco. This is a similar take on that same concept with a completely new dessert offering. Apple pies, delicious at $9.99. Apple strudel, $7.99. This mini all-American cake that you see right here actually comes with a warning. So first, 
$7.99. It's a warning, you might want to buy more than one. It has a highly decadent chocolate fudge icing. But before I purchased and consumed this in my car, which we'll get to in a moment, I had not one, but two costs. I love the way that I need to keep numbering with my hands as though you can't keep track anyhow. Weird habit, but I had two Costco employees come up to me. One to let me know that this decadent fudge dessert was absolutely delicious. And the other person just to warn me that it is really rich. And if you don't like chocolate, you're not going to want more than just a half a bite. Luckily, I love chocolate. So this was well worth the take home and the in-car consumption. I probably could have had more than one piece. It was certainly worth the $7.99 for the whole thing. If you're looking for an ice cream party box, this is $17.99. Think of this as your Cold Stone Creamery take home kit. It includes everything you would want for an entire ice cream party family night. You could actually host several people with this. Waffles, M&M's, sprinkles, Hershey's, chocolate syrups, nerds. It just keeps going. If you were to break down each of these ingredients and buy them at Dollar Tree, perhaps you might come out with a two or three dollar advantage, but this is pre-assembled for you and mighty handy. The 16 count Johnny Pops that you see right here, chocolate and strawberry, 10.99, and a 12 count of the Good Pop Orange and Cream Popsicles. So essentially, 12 creamsicles for $8.49. And by this point in my July Costco shopping haul, I needed to refresh myself after that chocolate fudge cake. So I did. And I consumed this in my vehicle, dairy free. And if you do care, not that I did at the time, only 90 calories per creamsicle. Awesome. In the number five spot, that was actually a weird hand motion I did. I had a comment in a prior video that I uploaded from a subscriber that wanted to know if there was something wrong with my arms. I don't know if it's just because of the way that I stand, but to my knowledge, I have normal arms or like relatively normal, like I can reach them, but I always, I don't know. I was, anyhow, this Dell Inspiron laptop, a phenomenal grab at $5.99, great for back to school or for anyone working from home. Well, the i5 processor is modest. The 12 gigabytes of RAM for under 600 bucks, plus the benefit of both a 256 gig solid state drive and a one terabyte hard drive. Great for any growing photo, video, or even gaming library. Well, this isn't necessarily a gaming desktop. It is a wonderful way to build a multimedia connection. Also great for the home office, this 10 sheet micro cut shredder. It's under 40 bucks, but if you guys recall several months ago, I purchased a shredder from the same brand at Costco when I brought it home. The $99 version that I bought had an 18 sheet capacity. This is the smaller sibling. Well, it does only handle 10 sheets for under 40 bucks. I will tell you, this is one of the quietest, best made paper shredders I have ever used. And I do recommend it even if you just spring for the smaller one. In the number six spot, before I get to DIY storage and fitness equipment, take a look at this Moleskin notebook assortment. A six pack for $19.99. If anyone has shopped back to school, college, or you're just trying to better organize around the household, Moleskin is one of those higher end brands that seems to resonate with people of all ages. The 188 count Band-Aid variety pack. It's the season of being outdoors more. My three-year-old just started a half day camp. This is definitely a product that we are stocking up on, 188 count of Band-Aids. I promise she is well supervised, but little accidents happen. And the 358 count American Red Cross for First aid kit for $24.99 includes scissors, tweezers, antibiotic treatments, you name it, it is encompassed in this great survivalist product and definitely a sale price is attached to it considering how much you get. In the number seven spot, some fitness products that are so heavily discounted if you're not that into the gym or fitness like I am. You might be. Let's begin with the smart rower that you see right here. This is an entire smart rowing system, $3.99. I have seen similar products advertised for quadruple the price. An entire treadmill, 625 bucks. This indoor cycle bike, my wife just got an almost identical brand. 385 is a great price given the research that I have now done on the popularity of these products. And the stepper elliptical that you see right here, 500 bucks, but it also comes with a free one year's worth of classes attached to it. So if a gym membership isn't affordable or convenient or you're like me, you just get nervous when you see weights and there's other intimidating men who don't have teenage bodies walking around near you, oh, I might take advantage of that. In the number eight spot of what you should be buying at Costco in July, a couple of great ways to get your grill game on. Let's begin with this Ninja Foodie Indoor Grill, a wonderful alternative if you do not have a barbecue or you're in an apartment or condo building where you are unable or not allowed to barbecue. One is $79.99 and will accomplish many of the same 
awesome grill tasks that you can now handle indoors. This six piece silicone kitchen mitt set, not a bad grab actually in 1999 because you get a pair of oven mitts, pot holders, grabber mitts, which all handle up to 500 degrees Fahrenheit. And if you were to go out and buy a good pair of oven mitts on their own, similar to what you would find in this kit, you're looking at 12 bucks just for the oven mitt. So $19.99 for everything included is wonderful. And the picnic caddy that you see right here with handles and under 25 bucks, also attractive for making more memories outdoors, tailgating, camping, you name it, it's all there. In the number nine spot, I wanna discuss some more food options and these caught my eye for a whole variety of reasons. This coconut curry chicken with mango, under 15 bucks, high quality and tastes very authentic. The new lemon herb chicken thighs at $3.99 a pound are enticing and so is the chicken pad thai at under 10 bucks. You're gonna find baked scalloped potatoes, $6.99 and an eight pack of grilled cheese toaster grills for $8.89. So if you do the math right here, you're going to get eight grilled cheese sandwiches for $8.89. Now my question is, if you buy your own bread and pair that with the cheese of your choice, wouldn't that be the better way to go? But I did double check with a Costco employee and I couldn't find any shoppers that had actually purchased this. And apparently, according to him, it does make the best most restaurant-like grilled cheese. So take it or leave it, but I did decide to at least include it. Now to briefly continue a couple of food mentions right here, if you frequently pay caterers or other people to assist with hosting larger parties, office events, anniversaries, special occasions, if you've never considered the catering platters at Costco, they are looking better than ever. Not a new concept entirely, but I think for the price range that generally runs somewhere between 26 and $35, whether it's the croissant sandwich platter, the chicken and Swiss rollers that you see right here, a whole platter of shrimp, Next time I might try and eat this in my car, as long as I keep the air conditioning on, or the meat and cheese platter that you see right here, all good catering considerations, which you can now find at your local Costco. In the number 10 spot, before I get to a topic of confusion and some great bonus items, let's move right into storage. The three pack of clear storage boxes that you see right here, 45 quarts, so you're getting a decent size capacity, $13.99. The 27 gallon yellow and black storage box that you see right here, $7.49. The four pack of buckle up clear storage sets, I think I might have profiled this brand in the past, but these are the smaller options that are ideal for toys, garage storage, laundry, $11.69 and I did mention at the beginning of the video, there might be a way to improve your bathroom storage space for 85 bucks. Take a look at this Teak Shower Bench. It provides storage options both on top of the bench and inside, and you can keep this in your bathroom or inside the shower. You could use it to store towels. So many different ways to make this work for you. I was highly intrigued. Also, just a brief mention right here, the 12 pack of one quart canning jars $14.99. In our family, we do keep our jars from our other various products, but canning season is approaching. If you're running low, perhaps this might be something for you. And now for the bonus buys of products that you should be considering at Costco this July, let's begin with a soon to be discontinued product, the Lavender Fabric Softener. I'm a little bit on the fence about this one. It's $6.99 and there are people warning you in some of the stores that this highly popular fabric softener scent is about to be discontinued. Well, we do love this in my house. My question is if it's so popular, why is it being discontinued? I don't know, maybe there's the cost of manufacturing, but Take it or leave it, that's a bonus section item. Now, if you know anything about sunflowers, I need your help on this next component. If you guys see these 12 inch sunflower plants in my local Costco, $14.99. I don't know if the ones that I saw on this particular day were in need of a little bit of TLC. I did record this video right after the 4th of July holiday weekend. Maybe they sat on a truck for longer than they should. Or maybe this is how sunflower plants look before they finally get bigger and grow beautifully. I don't know. One thing I can tell you is that the quality of flowers at Costco generally tremendous and of a very high standard. So I doubt Costco is trying to sell something that isn't good. I just, I don't really know a whole lot about sunflowers, so please feel free to leave me a comment. Now, one thing I do know a lot about, food, if that has not yet been made clear, the wild cooked king crab that you see right here, the wild shrimp, the lobster tails, the scallops, the whole tilapia, the tilapia fillets, the Atlantic salmon, the walleye, 
The sockeye salmon, one of my favorite higher grades of salmon at some truly attractive prices, which do fluctuate based on your local location. The halibut fillets and the cod are all tremendous offerings. So why am I flagging all of these seafood options? Well, if you guys watch my prior warehouse club upload for either Costco or Sam's Club, you might have noticed that most of the seafood options are frozen. And that's typically what we see in the summer. These are all fresh ready to consume for that perfect occasion. And I was very excited to see it at these prices. So there you go. I wanna thank all of you, not just in general for watching, leaving comments, helping guide the content, but if you've made it this far into the video, you are certainly a dedicated viewer or subscriber. If you are by any chance not a subscriber, please feel free to smash that subscribe button, turn your notifications on. If you guys do like this content, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. I'll have a new upload, perhaps tied to grocery shopping or some other secrets in my next upload right around the corner. Bye-bye.